Another student says an act of God saved him and dozens of his classmates because their school bus was late picking them up. KETV News Watch 7's Maddie Augustine continues our live team coverage. Maddie. Bill, Julie, the entire Perry community is stunned. Still trying to process what was supposed to be the first day of second semester, but now a nightmare. It is absolutely a nightmare. This is absolutely horrible. A nightmare for parents and their children. Amber Ross's daughter called her at the same time the first 911 call came in. I got a call exactly at 737. She told me she'd heard three gunshots and ran out the door. Junior Samuel Hernandez had just stepped through the front door. I go in and like the teacher like, was like, everybody's running out, the teacher comes in. It's like, there's not a drill, there's an active shooter in the building. So she takes me out. Hernandez turned and ran to a nearby park and called his mom. Still in shock, one of his classmates pulled the trigger. He was just kind of like a quiet kid. Like, he wouldn't really touch people. Dominic Reiner is also a junior. His bus was late to school. I almost want to see it as an act of God that that bus was late and that it, there was easily 40 other kids at that bus stop that all of their lives were saved because of that late bus. Jody Kurth says her stepson Xander was grazed by a bullet. She found out about the shooting from her daughter. It was a text message this morning from my daughter and it was absolutely horrifying. Like this. <laughs> One of the worst moments in my entire life. Local pastor and bus driver Rick Gates had just dropped kids off at the high school. Was at the elementary school when the principal came out and said, sit tight, hold your kids. There's been an incident at the high school. After a day filled with fear and sadness, Ross says she's grateful to hug her daughter. <laughs> Could have been her. A senior at Perry says she was wrapping up jazz band practice when she and her bandmates heard gunshots. They ran out of the school just trying to make it home safely. Bill, Julie, back to you. So many stories. Thank you, Maddie.